Hey guys, what is up? Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, whenever you're watching this. So, welcome back to Tiff Moss. This is day 10, 11. Let me give you a Christmas moment we'll fill with love and joy. Mm -mm, so beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe, baby, with you. I don't need any presents as long as I spend this day with you. It's day 11. I don't know. I'm losing my mind at this point. Um, I'm gonna be very honest with you guys here. I'm going through a little bit of like a depression wave right now. I'm all over the place. Today has been a crazy day for me and I was supposed to be vlogging all this week and I kind of, I feel like it's kind of been leading up to this big type of like depression wave. I have a hair mask in my hair. That's why my hair looks like this. Um, so I'm just like, just come spend the evening with me because I didn't vlog for the week so I don't know this is the best that I got for right now I do plan on vlogging for the weekend but I just couldn't do a weekly vlog this week I've just been so out of it and yeah so I'm making dinner right now so not only am I making dinner I am slightly meal prepping here because part of my depression that I'm going through is me being so stressed out because of money so I am meal prepping to kind of DoorDash and I was hoping I got my Instacart, my new Instacart card this weekend and so far she's nowhere to be seen. Love that for me. But it is what it is. So let me show you what I'm pulling out right now real quick. This isn't a full on meal prep. This is just getting something in the fridge so that I have it ready to go. Um, I have two of these, two packs. So I have four sausages and this is going to be enough to make for the weekend and for um like the beginning of next week as well i have a ton of peppers this whole container is full of cut up peppers and then i have a ton of mushrooms as well so i'm gonna make them uh like that i'm just gonna saute it in the pan get the veggies nice and so yeah i'm just gonna dice this up real quick and then all right so i got these mugs seasoned up just use whatever seasonings you like. I really don't care. But these are the seasonings that I use to season this. I did some of this roasted garlic and bell pepper. Some Lori seasoning. And then some adobo. You already know this. And we're just going to let these babies saute. I did not add any butter or oil to the pan. These should have their own oils in them. And they'll do their thing. Alright, so I just added my mushrooms. Mushrooms retain their own water. So eventually some water will come out. You might have to add a little salt to get, there you go, big mushroom. Holy crap. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to add my peppers here in a, a hot minute. I'm just letting these babies let out the excess water. All right. And then I add up my chopped peppers and throw that into the mix. And you guys see that water, that moisture right there? That is literally from the peppers. I haven't added anything. You just don't need it. And it just adds extra calories for no reason. So, boom. There we go. We got her all tossed in. This is going to be so good over rice. I'm not even going to lie. I'm so excited. I'm about to re-season. So, I'm going to go back in with those same seasonings. And I'm not going to go too heavy with it because I don't want to over-season. But it definitely, like, you can see that it needs more seasoning. Now here's the part where it's about to get a little different. Because you could just stop right here if you wanted to and just let the peppers cook a little bit more. But I feel like being extra, so I'm going to add some garlic powder. Then I'm going to add some Parmesan cheese. Because I'm thinking garlic parm here, parsley for color. Or I would add that, but I don't have it. So it is what it is. I'm going to add that in and it's going to be good. And then this is good to go. I don't want my peppers to be too, too soft here. But let me add the parm. And if you have to add more garlic for it to be garlicky, add more garlic. And this will thicken up this like kind of sauce that we made too. Mm, delicious. So here is the finished product. It tastes so good. It's so hot though, so I can't even eat it yet. But oh. All right, so now that I've eaten, that was delicious by the way. Uh, it was so simple, but so delicious. And I ate it over top some rice. Chef's kiss, I'm full. Satisfied. So me and my boyfriend are going to go uh, play some pinball 
and I need to, to get ready to go. I'm supposed to go pick them up at five. Um, it is not five. Uh, it, it is almost five. So I'm gonna get ready and I'm gonna go. <laughs> All right, uh, let me let me get ready. Okay, so I just got ready and I'm about to leave. Okay, so we're leaving now. Uh, my dad came home with some tostones. If you don't know what that is, it's basically a smashed fried plantain. I'm gonna take some to my boyfriend. Uh, I don't know if I've ever had him try them before, but they're so good. My grandma made them and I absolutely love them. I really can't eat them though now. You'll get your ball back with that free spin. We're playing pinball now. We're playing the Wheel of Fortune one. Alright, what is this score right now? I'm not trying to fuck. It. How am I? What? So Wait, there's more. It's not done yet. It's your turn. <laughs> what? <laughs> you know, she's got the multi ball. Oh, it's over. <laughs> they immediately just went off the side. Wow. I understand that. <laughs> I'm home and it's that time. I started to open it and then I was like, oh wait. Okay, so we got another little white one. Couldn't get this one off. Sit. Good boy. He will. Okay, so I gotta do mine. Uh, looking for number 10 on the Linden chocolate. Oh, it's right here. I really hope it's another one of the balls because I freaking love those Linden truffle balls. It's not. Okay. Whatever. The bears are the bears are just Lindit double milk chocolate. I'm not gonna eat this one. I'm gonna make an espresso. Let's make a warm sugar cookie latte. Let me show you how to make this. I'm just gonna throw this in my little drawer here. I don't really care to eat it right now. So what you need for this is you need the Gordelli sugar cookie um The chocolate, I cannot remember what it's called right now. Okay, so I'm gonna use one square. I get like a latte. I think that's what it is anyways from Starbucks. I think it's a latte. And... All right, swirl that around, get it all mixed up. And then the milk that I'm gonna use is the Fairlife fat-free milk and then this is the key you need this when you froth your milk you're gonna add a little bit of this and it's gonna oh, it so alright guys so it is actually Saturday and I'm eating my first meal which is literally the thing that I made yesterday the sausage thing that's going to be this, like, little vlog for today. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this. I really need to start the weekend vlog. I'm, like, so behind on this, but I promise we're going to get through this. I love you guys, and I will be here tomorrow, and the next day, and the next day, and the next day.